Forage should be the foundation of all our horses' diets, and for the majority of horses in California and across the US, that means hay. So if we know the nutrient content of our hay, we can use that as the foundation of the horse's diet, and we can then select supplements and commercial feeds and other products that work with the hay to ensure that that horse's diet is completely balanced and providing everything they need for optimal health and performance. So while you can take a grab handful of several bales to send in for analysis, that isn't gonna give you a representative sample of what's actually in your hay. So we need to use a probe to take a cross sample of the hay, and here is a Penn State Cora that you attach to a power drill that you then use to take a sample out of the hay bale. There are several different types of probe. This is a set of string is here. We obviously don't want it to cut through the strings but we want to go about 12 to 18 inches into the bale. And then we detach with this cora from the drill and then we're going to put our sample into a Ziploc bag and we're going to repeat that about 15 to 20 times from a representative number of bales from your stack and then we send that off to the lab to be analyzed. And I recommend that the sample be sent off to a lab in New York called Equi Analytical. Um, they actually will do an analysis specifically for the horse. There are many, many labs uh, in many states, especially in California, but they're often geared towards analysis for dairy cattle. And the analysis results you'll get, some of them will work for horses, but not all of them. We won't get the uh, equine digestive energy calculation and some of the minerals perhaps that we might need. So when you get your hay analysis back from the lab, it's gonna tell you a number of different things. You'll be able to tell the energy content, the protein content, it'll have all of the trace minerals, macro minerals, and also the amount of sugar and starch that's in your hay. And so this is really useful as a starting ground for them building the rest of your diet around. So it's important to get your hay analyzed as that's the basis of your diet. If you don't have enough hay to analyze it, you can use regional values. And working with a nutritionist, not only will they be able to help you understand the analysis you have, if you don't have an analysis, they can probably help provide you with regional values for hay grown in your area that you can use instead. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.